60 kids who left Ukraine after the war broke out are now receiving an education at a Catholic school in Chicago's Ukrainian village. Illinois Congressman Mike Quigley visited the kids and their families this morning and Gaynor Hall has more on his message as well as the refugees reaction. This school community has been working to help with the transition for dozens of refugee students who recently arrived from Ukraine. In the gymnasium of St. Nicholas Cathedral School this morning, students sang Ukrainian songs and presented bread to welcome Democratic Congressman Mike Quigley. Our job is to welcome you and give you all the opportunities this country has to offer. Parent Alina Pakomova raised a concern with the congressman. I still wait my documents. I still wait my work permit. She wants to work, but she's still waiting for permission. I wait, wait, and still wait. And when I call, they told me that my document's in progress. That is problem. I admit it's a problem. Quigley said his office will provide direct assistance while also working with the Biden administration to try to speed up the paperwork process. Pakomova journeyed to the U.S. five months ago with her two children. Her husband is still in Ukraine. It's very hard, really. It's hard uh, emotional, physical. It's for, you know, it's, it's just hard. She said the school community has been a big help. The numbers have fluctuated, but out of 200 students, about 70 here are Ukrainian refugees. The school hired more staff to help the children adjust. We want them to know that they're welcome, right? They're loved, we care for them, and we're glad that they're safe. And we're going to keep them safe while they're here. As the war drags on, Quigley says he is concerned Russian President Vladimir Putin is growing more desperate. And with lawmakers divided, Quigley supports Ukraine's accelerated bid to join NATO. Victory looks like a country, a sovereign democratic country made whole. Victory looks like those who committed atrocities are held accountable. And finally, victory is Ukraine made whole and that all its territories are returned and it is secure. We want to live free in our country. And from scholarships to supplies, the school has been collecting donations to assist families living in Chicago while the war in Ukraine continues. Reporting from Ukrainian Village, Gaynor Hall, WGN News. Thank you, Gaynor.